do some heavy duty batoning. Somewhat heavy duty. This is my hand carved baton. I actually carved that one with uh, my Leroy. See how it does on this big bass. It's just pretty wet, rotten. Probably not going to do very well. Just taking big hunks of it off. It's not really actually splitting it because it's just too damn wet. There you go. I like butter. I don't remember whose video it was I was watching. It was on the uh, Survive Knives uh, GSO-10. And he was, uh, he was talking about batoning. And I've seen a lot of videos where people say, Oh, you should never need to baton your knife. Get an axe and blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I have an axe. Could I split it with an axe or a hatchet even? Yeah. But like this guy said, I don't, I don't remember what what the name of the channel was. Like I said, it was on a GSO-10 video, which is a beautiful fucking knife. Way out of my price range, but still a beautiful knife nonetheless. Uh, he was um, he was batoning with his, and you know he got on the discussion about how. People say, oh, you should, you should use an axe. And um, He said that he kind of considers batoning sort of like whittling. And I, I kind of agree. Could I have split that with a hatchet? Yeah. Would it have been easier? Maybe. Um, is it more enjoyable to baton for me? Yeah, absolutely. Um, and that's why I actually took the time to carve out an actual baton. Uh, and I have beat the piss out of this baton. Um, worth badass. Uh, whatever type of wood this is, super hard. Um, like, I, I'm not tossing big chunks of it off. And, and you can see it's been pretty heavily used. This is actually my my stepdaughter's baton. She's nine. Hard to handle out for her also. She uh, she likes to baton with her, uh, her more companion. Um, <clears throat> and again, it's a small knife. Should it be batoned with? Eh, maybe not. Maybe so. Uh, I think it's just kind of up to the user. Like I said, I like the baton, and I completely agree with what the dude said. It's uh, it's kind of like kind of like whittling. I don't know. That's just it's my thoughts on batoning. Um, I will continue to baton. Um, I think it's I think it's definitely a uh, a useful. Um, a useful, uh, oh, useful action, um, and I, I don't, I don't think it's putting any, any stress on your blade. Um, as long as I mean you're not using, you know, it's, as long as it's not metal on metal contact, I don't see where it's going to damage your blade, um, unless you just have an already damaged blade. I think it'd be good. My two cents. Not that anyone really asked my two cents, but there you go.